controls when you are talking about the controls i am giving you a a complete a complete understanding about the things how the controls will work is right we we i am giving you a complete a, a, a is right when you see it is a controls controls are divided under three different segments okay the first is a, the first one we are talking in terms of general controls is it right? what are this the yes from the next week yeah monday and wednesday we want to start from six o'clock no problem you just uh, place it on the group uh, uh, that okay. we, we want to start at six o'clock inshallah if everybody agrees we will do okay no problem okay okay anything is there you just put in for me for me no and uh, uh, just i want to remind you that uh, i am starting uh, from the if you uh, as per your convenience uh, i am starting the uh, state, uh, next semester from december 11th is it right and i am very very i am getting good response alhamdulillah and uh, i will i will do strategic business reporting uh, it is uh, uh, it is another wise called as a uh, finan advanced financial reporting it is a financial accounting paper if anybody wish wish you your wish if you are doing wish to do just let me know so that i will give first preference for timing okay one class will be from 4 to 6 i will take four classes for that it is advanced paper it needs more efforts it's not six hours it will be eight hours so i will put one class from four to six another classes from 6 30 to 8 30. just you convey the message anybody is interested you can if you are also interested let me know fine come back to this when you are talking about the controls is it right how the controls will work there are three types of controls the first one is general controls the second one is application controls is that the, the second one is application controls and the third one is IT controls information technology controls is that so control environment is very important see internal controls when you are talking about the inter controls it entirely depends on what internal auditor is that internal auditor is is resp so so so, so solely responsible for the internal controls and if internal controls are good definitely we are going to have a more effective system of working okay now when we talk about the internal controls internal controls are also have a different way of working is that you have the controls as such and you have the test of controls see controls is one thing test of controls is another thing don't get confused controls are in place fine are these controls are working that is also important is it right and when you are talking about the test of controls you have test of controls and subsequently this will not will leave us substance you procedures the substantive procedure we are going to work on this next when you are doing the things this is the first this is the this is the first concept this is the second concept okay definitely on in, in subsequently we are going to have we are going to have its way of evaluation is that you will evaluate whether the controls are in place are in working is right how effective the controls are there and how their controls has to be has to be uh, has to be improved as such is it right now what we are going to study in this lecture is we are talking about the first one is internal control systems generally then we say how the you how the auditors will use when we are talking about the auditors see internal auditors and statutory auditors is it right? internal auditors and the both are totally dependent on internal controls as simple as that the then what we do the same thing we will evaluate whether the internal controls are effective or not and most importantly we are having controls now we have done in the previous case 
we have done something with respect to computer assisted audited techniques a simple uh, a simple uh, introduction we have done now we are going to have the uh, controls over its uh, uh, evaluating control of the computerized environment okay now one see where, what is the question how the question will work is it right that's very important they will say that identify is it right? the 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 moment the moment they are coming up with this is identify the deficiencies is it identify the deficiencies of what identify the deficiencies of internal control and they will ask you to give the recommendations is it right? they will ask you to do the recommendation this is the way the things will work okay if a very very important see it will come means it will come see that's the reason is right now they they have divided what they have divided into 10 marks 10 marks 10 marks is right 20 20 and 30 is right so at any way they will they will going to assess this one is it in at any point of time things will work on this aspect Aisha, where is Aisha joining the camp? Yes, Salah Alaikum Aisha. Is it? No. What, what are the things we will work? We will talk about why the inter, why, why, explain why the auditor needs to up, understanding the the internal control activities. See, you are an auditor. You will you will make sure that whether the internal controls are in place or not. See, you will assess how the system is working, how people are how people are evaluating, how people think the activities. The process is moving from one stage to another stage. Fine. Is it? Now, there are five components of internal control. Is it? There are five components. Is it? I am underlining it. This is the examination question as such. Is it? This is the examination question. What, what, what are the five different components? We are talking in terms of control environment. We are talking about, we are, we are going to, what is, how the control environment means, how, how the, means, in terms of receiving the inventory, in terms of purchasing, in terms of assets, in terms of payables, in terms of cash management. Is it right? Everywhere there is a control environment. How you are receiving the inventory, how it is recorded, how it is going to be processed and how it is going to be moved. Is it right? It's a lengthy process what we are talking about. We are talking about the, when the second point is we are talking, we will see how the risk assessment, how we are assessing the risk, is it right? Whether the controls are effective, the risk is less, is it right? I will write here, if controls, controls are effective, is it right? If controls are effective, what is the risk is less, is it right? Now when I, I will put the things automatically, it will make sense for us in the next phase. Now, what happens is, these are information systems, including related business processes with respect to financial reporting and communication. What happens, when we do the things, we are not going only to have general controls. What I told you, again I am writing, is that we have a general controls, is that we have a application controls, is that we have the application controls, application controls in terms of financial statements, okay? And we have something called as IT controls. Mm -hmm. Is it? That, that, that's what it. Control activities relevant to the audit, how the controls are, have the relation, how it is going to have impact on the audit. And most importantly, we are talking about monitoring of the controls. We should not say that we have, we have a control in place. Is it right? We have control in place. Once you have controls, 
definitely you should make evaluation and subsequently we have to make what we have to make improvements is it this is what we, we are talking explain how the auditors record internal control procedures is it there are various different methods are there is it right? they will ask you for two or three marks is that it's not difficult flow charts are there N narrative notes are there you have internal co control questionnaires are there and you have internal control evaluation questionnaires is that these are the four methods we are going to use is that the first one is narrative notes is that the second one is what the second one is flow charts the third one is internal control questionnaires the th fourth one is internal control evaluation questionnaires is that these are the four methods in all the methods there are some advantages and disadvantages what ex eval ex evaluate internal component internal control components what are the what we are doing this is the examination they will ask the one of the examination question is five components another imp important examination question is what they have to identify deficiencies and you have to give recommendations for those deficiencies and subsequently we are talking about limitations of internal control components is it now apart from that you will have see i i have mentioned it you have general controls you have it controls and you have application controls is it right and you know, again they are saying they are talking in terms of you have to identify deficiencies and you have to give recommendations to the deficiencies see in the in the quiz is it right in the quiz see when they ask you five today only i have i have reviewed the quizzes okay when they ask you five you have to mention five you should not mention three is it right you have you it's it, see now it is i know it is a time constraint it is uh, it is typing uh, speed we need what i am suggesting you okay advising you you be see the purpose of having the quiz is you have to make sure that you have to leave you have to meet those time time factors okay so next time be little bit careful on that to overcome the they will they will ask you the the deficiencies and they will ask you the recommendation describe why smaller entities have different control environment always we will say that we will always don't focus on on the big industries big companies see the thing now if you take into consideration most of the countries they are talking about what small and medium enterprises is it right they are talking about small and medium enterprises from small and medium enterprises how best we can have the control environment because what happens this when we are talking about the controls definitely controls needs what it need it is going to have its impact on the cost is it right it will have impact on the cost as such so we have to be very assured about the uh, limitations or the uh, exposure to be given for the small and medium enterprises there are two things one is test of controls and one is substantive procedure see why people students get confused student gets confused with respect to substantive procedures substantive procedures will be there subsequently in all the lectures from now onwards but it is having a different way of understanding okay different way of presentation i will tell you what is the difference it will happen is that that is the things we are going to cover is that in general we will say that what are the, the components of control environment internal controls we are talking in terms of methods of uh, internal controls uh, taking into consideration how we are going to record it we will have different types of internal controls we will say what are the deficiencies and what are the recommendations is it now when we do the things what what happens in inter see the thing inter you have internal control systems are there you are using use of internal controls by the auditors auditors will specifically when we say it is a auditors statutory auditors only 
Is that? And you have a computer system controls. Now you will say, see, very simple. You have computer system controls in terms of access. Is it right? In terms of passwords. Is it right? In terms of approvals. Is it right? Is it right? And most importantly, in terms of access to the data. Whenever it is happening, is it? Right? Nobody should should have access to the master file. Is it? Right? They should have access to which file which type of file? Transaction file. Is it? Master file. See, what, what, what access to the master file? See, what happened? Master file is nothing but list of suppliers will be there. Is it right? List of suppliers will be there. You have the price list will be there. Is it right? You have the price list. Is there. Nobody should have access to this. Is that list of? You cannot you change the list of suppliers. Is it right? You will ch cannot change the price list. That is the reason they are making a they are making a line between this and in every question every question they will have this point to make that the the master file should be accessed by a responsible person the master file should not be accessed by a by a supervisor or by a clerk or by a purchase clerk sales clerk all those things is it right this is one of the general deficiency of the internal controls which is going to be uh, assessed in every other question wherever it is possible okay responsibilities of the management and the responsibility of the management is to design is it right that to design one minute i will write more clearly sorry is it the responsibility of the management is what the responsibility of the management is to design the responsibility of the management is to implement is it the responsibility of the management is to evaluate and the auditor's responsibility is nothing but to verify is it right? to ensure is it to ensure that controls are in place is it and whenever we do the things we have done this documentation is it right documentation of the system is very important you will see that whether there is a who has the access who can change who 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 are you responsible for for the modifications is it right who who is doing which job that is very very important whenever we are talking about the documenting the system is it continuation to the previous slide is it right you will have the what are the examples of internal controls and you will have the limitations is it here you will have the general controls and you have the application controls as such is it it is a brief overview about how what we are going to do in this lecture as such the same thing happens is that we are not we are not going to have anything differently is it? you are planning the audit understanding the entity very important internal controls understand the entity and without understanding the entity we cannot work anything is right we cannot we cannot uh, process further as such if when we will have the controls as such is right you will have the controls as such the controls will test the controls whether the controls are effective see again i am repeating controls are different is it right test of control is different we are con we are testing the controls that are effective or not is it right next if there is satisfactory we will do restrictive procedures if it is unsatisfactory we will do the, de the full substantive procedure subsequently we will report to the management other things will come into place is it what is the concept what is what is the basic concept it is they will they will never see a acc examination they will never ask you the definition they will not ask you what is the no they will never they will never touch that but before we could be without this we cannot progress what is the pro, what is the internal it's a process design only designing is very important is it right designing and affected by whom it is the responsibility of the management is it, it is the responsibility of the management is it that the internal controls have to be designed and it has to be effective 
what we are doing in internal controls in internal controls we are giving a reasonable assurance about the achievement of the see is is a reasonable assurance that the things are moving fine reasonable assurance stating that the 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 process is effective got my point somebody is see i will i will i will make it a point you are talking in terms of a simple concept of inventory is it right i will give example for inventory i will give example for cash also when you are saying inventory definitely what will happen you are, you are receiving inventory is that you are purchasing is that when it is purchased you will receive inventory definitely when you are receiving inventory you will what you will do you you will you will verify with the invoice is it right you will verify with the supplier is it right you will verify with the price list is it you will verify with the quantity is it one person will receive is it right the see segregation of duties is it right one person will receive one will receive and one will record is it right? one will record again what we are doing we are talking about segregation of duties is it right this is in a simple of the simplest way i am i am putting the things is that right? in the simplest of the simplest way Alhamdulillah. Is it right? in the simplest? Sorry, in the simplest of the simplest way, inventory. Is it how we are receiving the inventory? Very simple. The process is that there is a front end process, there is a back end process. If you take that into consideration, this is nothing but the control environment. Is it in the similar way? Cash. cash is going to have the same same impact is it right when you are doing the cash what will happen some one will receive cash is it right one will do reconciliation is it right one will do reconciliation one will person will review is it right three people will be there the task will be divided if you take in simple process this is called as a control environment they will say yes if you are doing a reconciliation if you are doing a reconciliation is the reconciliation has been has been uh, uh, verified has been authorized has been uh, approved by the senior management is it right if that that's what it says if, if the, the most important anyway the same rule will apply is it the person who is charged with the governance has the has reviewing the reconciliation or not is right that's what what we are doing it gives a reasonable assurance you know complete assurance that the things are reliable okay in terms of finance it talks about another aspect it talks about effectiveness and efficiency of operations is it it means what happens is the ac every under industry will have what every other industry will have some rules and regulations is that what the internal control what the internal auditor will do internal auditor will only see that whether you are following rules and regulations that are in place or not as simple as that is it right the internal auditor will do the, the that the basic aspect they will follow is that this is what it says what is the concept of internal control it is design effective Uh, affected by the people who are charged with governance it is by the management or the persons to provide what to provide a reasonable assurance as such is it as a reasonable assurance as such is it and we'll see we we'll see what are the how the now where the internal controls will work is that this is the one of the it is not a co examination question but they are talking about the food industry see what happens in the food industry there is a packing date and there is expiry date is it right that we have to do about enter food industry what is happen who are the people who are list of suppliers is it right? approved suppliers that's what it says whenever we are going to place the order you have to get the 
get it from the approved suppliers only is it right you should have something with respect to inspection is it right you should have something with respect to inspection these are the things basic things that will work for us you are an audit senior responsible for a audit of a supreme food limited a company which runs a fast food stores similar to this examination questions will be there i can say with that much authority is that similar to this the major risk in this type of industry is always talks about what it always talks about the quality which might damage claims so see what will happen if you don't see you as simple as that very simple if you go to any 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 stores is that retails so you go to the that have hypermarkets whatever is there you see the thing some people are there who always check the packing date and expiry date is it right packing date and expiry date always they will have that their job is that only is it right the job is that only you have to remove the expiry date products from the shelf okay you have to remove expiry date from product from the shelf as such otherwise what will happen if any claim is there definitely people will file legal cases against the company okay and it's really it takes a big thing what control should the company have in place to reduce the risk associated with the purchase of food is it right this is what a simple basic concept is it right now when we talk about the food industry possible controls could be used to reduce the risk with respect to purchase what are the thing they are saying that whenever we are talking about the food industry is it right see they should be done by whom they should be done by a designated person a responsible person has to be there in it has to be in the hands of a responsible designated approved authorized person who is going to ensure that the food what we are going to purchase is of good quality got no point the first thing the second aspect what they say they should be a approved list of suppliers got no point this is very important see now you don't need further explanation first first few minutes whatever i explained it makes sense and automatically you can go further okay you should have a designated person who is going to look into it food inspector the second is they should purchase from the approved suppliers to ensure that food comes from the sources with respect to quality standards next third one these are the standard answers or standard response is it right the first you should understand that is the reason we'll say that we have to understand understand the entity environment is it right entity we have to en understand the environment automatically you are understanding the environment your answers will be on your fingertips nothing is difficult very simple this people say this this not it was only thing is you should have very calculated mechanical i will say mechanical approach scientific approach has to be there yes you are talking about food industry immediately you have to close your eyes and think two minutes yes what are the things happen in the food industry automatically it should be a reflection of that when the food is received is that it should be inspected is that you should not see when when you are receiving the food it should be inspected by the informed people including those responsible for food preparation means when when you are receiving the food it should be inspected that's why the reason what what will happen in most of the cases is it right there will be a stamp will be there in the stamp they will say that it is inspected inspected they will put the date also is it right they they inspected date they will they will put the signature also who has inspected this food is it right these things they will say they will put the date they will do. that's what it says it by because they want to make sure that it has to be done by a desired quality what we are doing now we are going to use a concept called as this is this is one we have to remember from now onwards whenever you are receiving what you will see you are talking in terms of grn 
goods received note i will not use the word again is that g r n means goods received note is it right? you will have another this is with respect to what this is with respect to whenever you make a purchase whenever you make you are receiving the goods is it right in the same way whenever there is a sales you will have a gdn goods delivery note is it right when we are talking about the sales goods receive uh, goods delivery note when you are talking about purchases goods received note when you are talking in terms of non current assets you are talking about non current assets register these are the first source of documents is it right should be signed to provide evidence of the receipt and the inspection this is not this is a sample of goods received note slowly take your time understand so that see the moment you understand the concepts very well yesterday you have experience you can do your questions very easily is it right if if you focus only on on examination questions it's very difficult is it right you should this if you find it uh, clarity here it makes sense food should be kept in a clear place in a refrigerator we have to think about the temperature also is it right control temperature is it right you should work with what we have to work with the control temperature if necessary to ensure that the quality is retained is right revise this once class is over you revise these six points is right anything related to food industry make it a point there should be a strict adherence to the use by dates is that right? in terms of what in terms of packing date and in terms of expiry there should be the, this is the point number 5 there should be a person in the company who has overall responsibility for health and safety and those people should have training is it right? this is point number 6 this list is exhaustive they are not saying that this is the only list you have the list that is the reason you should have the uh, we have the food inspectors is it right? you you see the canteens in your workplace also any anyway is it anywhere any time is it at right? once i went at about 10 o'clock is it right? to have the, they, they, to have the food inspectors will come any time is it right? they will come at any time and they have the checklist and they will put the checklist and according to the checklist they will work it out why do auditors need to understand internal control why what is the need is it right because it helps them what are the potential factors that was going to affect the risk see why you have to uh, need to understand internal control we are talking about food industry yeah food industry how the things will work what are the various factors that are going to be concerned to the food industry you should maintain yeah, it has to be stored in a controlled environment temperature it has to have packing and expiry date it has to be inspected by a by a responsible person is it right it has to be received when you are when receiving the good product uh, food co related inventory it has to be of a quality on the based on the quality is that these are the things that is needed for whenever we are thinking in terms of the auditors to understand the internal control any industry as simple as that desire the nature and timing and extent of their audit procedures w which type of what we are doing we are doing audit for inventory we are doing audit for quality we are doing audit for purchases is it right we are audit doing auditing for sales is it that's very important is it 315 is it right? 315 i really appreciate it is it that right? i really appreciate that you are sending the 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 li updated list of what happens uh, with respect to the uh, with respect to the standards is it right 
good now is it we will we will make sure about assessing the risk of material misstatements through what through understanding the entity and its environment fine one minute one minute fine now what it says if internal controls are good is it a good means what if internal controls are effective The auditors can rely on the audit audit work of what test of controls, and they can reduce substantive procedures. Means they don't want to do that much detailed procedures. Is it right? They can they don't want to do that much detailed procedures as such. They can do only they can reduce the things. Subject to what condition? Subject to the condition that subject to the condition that the controls are effective. if internal controls are not effective then what it is needed they need a full substantive audit is that that's what it says is that you have controls is it right you have controls you have test of controls is that i'm writing again is it very important you have test of control if the if the th these are effective is it if our effect means yes play everything is in place that what you will do you will do you are you are reducing what you are reducing substantive procedures is it right you are reducing what you are reducing substantive procedure if internal controls are not effective definitely you will go for a detail or you will go for a full substantive procedures is it no what are the five different components are they you it has to be there on 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 the on your fingertips okay i will see i will i will ask as many things as possible now uh, my activity on group will increase the moment i will put a question i will put a question in a normal time only okay And then you if, if that is the case, uh, some way from 5 to 6 i will i will put one or two questions on the group you have to anybody one has to respond is it right whoever have the access first access you have five different components controlled environment risk assessment process the information systems control activities and monitoring of controls in the next few slides we will go this we will do this in detail okay what is the controlled environment see control environment comes from the management understand what the how the management will perceive how the management will think how the manage how much the management wish to spend understand what the more you spend the more the controls will be effective very simple very clear 
it includes the governance and management functions is it right what is the attitude is it how what is the attitude how the management is aware on and what are the actions of those charged with governance what is the control environment control environment is nothing but the the management functions with respect to attitudes how they are charged with governance is right they are concerned about what internal controls and most importantly they are talking in terms of importance see the banks very simple i will i i will never name the bank see the banks in some banks things are very very tough they will say that you get this paper it will be done in some banks what will happen okay fine okay they they will consider it is it right in some banks you see the you see the apps of the banks in some banks the concept is apps are very very stringent you cannot change anything flexibility is not there at all whereas in some apps there is a flexibility every bank wants to make sure that the controls are very effective you are paying the amount you are getting an otp on your phone and the otp is for 30 seconds or 120 seconds or 60 seconds it is a control environment you know you are getting an otp on your on your on your mobile phone is it right that that's what is a simple concept of a control environment you want to change the phone number we cannot do what happens immediately you with the registered registered mobile number is it registered mobile number is the is the is the interface is it right it is the interface interface between the bank and the customer any communication which you are going to do from the customer's point of view and from the bank point of view it will be through what it will be from the registered mobile number only got my point that that the most specific thing that is what we call it as a control environment auditors must understand the environment because the control environment can affect the risk of material misstatements if this 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 process is effective definitely the material misstatements will be less is it if it is process you cannot change your mobile number you cannot call a call a call call center and say that i want to change my mobile number it will never happen you have to go to the bank you have to put your id card then it will access then only they will change understand what? that is what the management has to be has should have the awareness to make the things very effective with respect to internal control if the awareness is coming from the management automatically the systems down the line will be followed how will is it right this is what it says now what is the there are various various different activities they have mentioned communication and enforcement by integration with ethical values is it right when we are talking about the thing essential elements will influence the effectiveness of the design administration and monitoring we have to design the management has to design the, the administration means they have to make sure that it is operational and most importantly you have to monitor of controls is it next second one what it says it has to have competent level competence levels for particular jobs means see that is the reason you have controls controls will be there but controls will not be implemented there is no use of having those controls not implemented is it there is no point of having the controls if you have the controls you should have skilled people is it right you should have skilled people who can enforce to implement those controls you should give training from time to time there should be a this right that makes the difference third one we will we will cover this is it right this is where the the third one what it says it says that participation by those charged with governance is it right 
you should have independence from management you should see that is the reason any job a person is doing if a employee is doing he has to follow the rules and regulations is it right nobody should interfere in those rules and regulations independence has to be there yes i am following these rules and regulations fine as simple as that things will be clear experience and stature you should have complete exp con awareness is it right you should know that yes these are the controls are there these are the things we have to implement these are the things where there will be a fraud and error control risk is it right audit risk here you will have some some fraud and error you should have experience that yes this area extent of involvement and scrutiny of activities is that you should always what you will do you should always evaluate is that you have to have a scrutiny scrutiny means you have to monitor what what is going right and what is going wrong and immediately there is a appropriateness of actions is that appropriate actions are interactions with what you you should interact with both internal auditors and external auditors fine means who are the charged with governance now you understand the people who are at the management level the people who are having experience the people who are evaluating the things and most importantly it is the internal auditors as well as the external auditors is it right means both everyone are group under one category the third fourth one management philosophy the operating style is it right see what happens some manage see very simple some managers some management is very 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 easy going people some management are very very now not say strict but they follow the principles is it right? they follow the principles that is the reason the philosophy and operating style approach to taking managing and business risk is it right how you are talking in terms of financial reporting how seriously you are taking about financial reporting and what is how you are working with respect to what information processing it see it controls are nowadays we are talking in terms of it controls all through the time is it right we will we will take this into these are the control environments is that organization structure what are what it says that see as simple as that how how the things will flow from top to bottom is that these are the people who are the top those are the people who will design is that who are the who will design the internal controls is that the responsible lies with the management the responsible lies with the charge with governance is it how it is going to be planned design executed and controlled and more importantly it is reviewed i will use different 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 colors here is it right the how you are going to plan how you are going to execute is it right how you are going to how you are going to control and most importantly how you are going to review it One, two, three, four. Is that one, two, three, four? And now, when you have the control, what is more important? Somebody have the authority and responsibility. Is it right? Somebody has to take the authority. Somebody is responsible. More importantly, somebody is accountable. If you put authority and responsibility both together, is it? Understand carefully. If you are putting authority and authority means yeah you are giving some powers is a responsibility means they are accountable is right this one there are respond they, they have to they have to respond in both either case then those people are called as accountable is right there should be a there should be a authority and responsibility more importantly they should be accountable and last but not the least is it right they talk about what they talk about they talk about the human resources people are there see the things nowadays very simple is that people we, people the employees are there but employees doesn't have that much sufficient and training and skills 
to work on that in that case things will not work yeah risk how you are going to assess the risk the auditors needs to obtain an understanding of the whether process are in place in the following you will say that see what are the see we are talking about the business risk and we are talking in terms of financial risk is it identifying the risk what what is the business risk is it what is the business risk when you are talking about when take the example of food industry is it right take the trailer if the call if the quality of the products is less is it right automatically what will happen the claims will be will increase is it right the claims will increase is it if there see any food poisoning is it right food poisoning happening here right here we find very less is it right if you go to european countries western countries is it right a small thing will happen maybe you you may heard in so many times on social media that in 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 some food eatables you will come across some insects is it right you come some some come up, some some rotten things is it right immediately the customer will file a claim against the companies understand that is most important with respect to it is called as a business risk is it right? if it, that is called as a business risk when there is a business risk definitely it will have impact on the financial statements is it right? estimating the significance of the risk how risk is going to influence and how probability of their occurrence is that probability of occurrence is very important if it's occurring again and again is that if it is going to have happen again and again it will the risk is going to be have is going to have a higher element and you as a managers you have to take the this deciding upon the actions to address those types of risk means entity risk assessment process internally is it right you should evaluate the business risk you should know how the risk is going to be classified with respect to the internal controls this is the reason this is the this is the one of the reasons why in ev every other case you see i take take the example i will give an example of bmw is it right i will take the example of the the cars is it right when you talking about the cars they will go through lot of tests before the car is roll out of the manufacturing unit is that you take the iphone why iphones are apple iphones are so so expensive is it right compared to other other very simple other chinese phones because they 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 go through the through the rigorous test as such before the phones are going to be launched is it right so there should not be any bugs that is the business risk that is the way we are talking in terms of internal controls what are the information systems relevant to financial control see when you are talking about the financial is that now what happens as simple as that you have a barcode scanner is it right you have a barcode scanner when you have the this is what the information systems we talking about the moment you have a barcode scanner is it right automatically what will happen you your sales register will get updated your inventory will get updated is it right how many things will get updated just imagine you are talking about to maintain accountability of assets liabilities and equity what they are saying first understand it a component of internal control includes financial reporting system consists of procedures and records established to initiate to record process and report entity transactions what are the things we are initiating we are recording we are processing and we are reporting at one at one time it's happening understand but at one time the moment you are scanning the product what will happen the sales will the sales the sales will increase 
is it right? the inventory will decrease is it right? the inventory will decrease the cash will increase is it right? whether you you it will have impact on profits or it will have impact on losses is that automatically what will happen the equity component will also increases or decreases based on the profits and losses understand this is what integration is that information systems now you understand how 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 important is there with respect to a barcode scanner is that as an auditor you should you should make sure that yes we are it's not only a sales is it right it not only sales it, it it have impact on different elements of financial statements and ultimately it will have impact on what it will have impact on the equity also what we are doing in this process we are initiating we are recording we are processing and subsequently we are reporting The auditor must understand the system. How you see that? What? How the things will flowing? That's very important. As is it? Right? The auditor must understand what are the classes of transaction. How the sales is working? Is it? Right? How the sales is working? How the how it is going to have impact on the financial statement? It's not only that. Is it? Right? The, that is the reason you see about the sales. The moment there is a sales, what will happen? It will have impact on income statement. It will have impact on on the balance sheet it will have impact on the cash flow statement it says that the procedures have both information technology and manual systems the, 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 the procedures are there you can work out in both the ways but in when either way you are doing in whichever way you are doing it has to be initiated it has to be recorded it has to be processed it has to be corrected is it right transferred is it right it has to be transferred to where it has to be done in the general ledger and reported in the financial statements see you see i uh, see now see as a see you start with an audit you will come across so many things is it right assume you are talking in terms of sales is it what will happen as that in terms of sales first first is you will have a sales day book in the similar way when you are talking in terms of purchases you will have a purchase day book i don't know whether you have done this in your bachelor's or not but this is the first step in accounting is it right you will have a day book first and foremost you will see what is the sales day book purchase day book during the day what purchases happen in if you are taking all the things you will have so many transactions you will have the total is it right this is going to be called as a sales for the day you will have 30 months this is going to be called as a sales for the month you have 12 months this is going to be called as a sales for the year the first source of document is what sales day book understand what after that ledgers will come general sub ledgers will come general ledgers will come trial balance will come income statement will come that is the second step the first and foremost thing is you have to think about sales day book you have to think about the purchase day book similarly i have told you and it is very important you will have a non current assets register is it these are the things where it will have impact on the on the financial state the related accounting records is it the supporting document information and specific accounts of financial statements are talking about what talking about the same process means now when you you are talking in terms of a information system imagine the importance of a barcode see sometimes it happens not sometimes everyone has experienced it is it right everyone has experienced it 
I am giving you a very very clear example. Is it right? You have a cashier. Is it right? You have a cashier. What happens? Maybe he has scanned mistakenly. Is it right? He has scanned mistakenly two times. Is it right? He has scanned mistakenly twice. Is it right? No. Or you have scanned it and you want don't want to do, take that. Okay. What happens? He the cashier cannot cancel that that transaction. What will happen? A supervisor will come. Is it right? He a supervisor will come. He will unlock the system. Is it right? He will cancel it. Is it right? And again he will lock the system. Understand what? This is what the control environment. This is what the information systems with respect to the financial reporting. A simple way of I am telling you. A cashier will scan it mistakenly. He cannot cancel it. The supervisor will come. He will scan it. He will unlock the system. He will scan the. He will cancel the transaction. Immediately he will lock the system. Then only they can process further. This you you have to make sure that how things are like. Information the auditor must understand how the how the system captures the events. This is what is happening. Is it right? what happening? The barcode is capturing the event. Is it right? And other than transactions that are significant to financial statement, the financial process used to prepare entity statements, including what. We are talking in terms of accounting estimates as well as in terms of disclosures. Means whenever you are talking about the preparation of financial statements, is that what what we are doing? We are talking about what are the control factors? Is it right? What are the information control factors? See wherever it's happening. Most importantly, what the finance managers will do? They will make the budgets. They will make the budgets and they will compare with actual. Budgets is nothing but a control, a control tool, is it right? Budget is nothing but a control tool. The moment I say I don't know, yeah, you if you are working with the accounts department, immediately something will come, is that? Definitely you you will see whether the budget is there or not. If the budget is there, then only you will approve. If budget is not there, you will not approve. This is an example of the. Financial reporting controls, control surrounding general entries, including non-standard general entries, or in in other words, non-recurring or unusual transactions. See what happens is that assume you will have see you will have a uh, take an example you will have a petty cash, is that every every organization every department will have a petty cash. What the petty cash is that the amount of budget of petty cash is how much to five hundred riyals? Is it right? Now you cannot exceed five hundred riyals. Is it right? You cannot go beyond five hundred riyals on any particular date. If you are going a beyond five hundred riyals, immediately what will happen? There will be a trigger. There is a rule that that what it says is that there is a rule unusual transaction. Is it right? The transaction is not of a similar. Nature as such. Is it right? This is where we are talking in terms of the control environment. What are the control activities? Is it? What are the control? What are the control activities? There is an authorization control. Who is going to authorize it? There will be a review with respect to the performance. There will be a Information processing. Who will do the? Who will do the processing of the information? Sometimes you will have physical controls over the assets, and over the liability. Mostly assets, is it right? And apart from that, there will be a segregation of duties. One minute. I will just. I will have a glass of water.
Salalim Ansari Tahir Zakaria Is it? Next. Fine? Now, what it says, you, ha you have the, the, those points, what are the control activities? Is it right? What are the control activities? Are the, the, the policies and procedures to ensure that the management directives are carried out, whatever the management says. They have the authorization control. Who is going to authorize it? Who is going to approve it? Who is going to review it? Is it right? Who is going to take the backup? And who will have the physical possession of the, uh, the, the assets? And most importantly, how there is a segregation of duties as such. Is it? Can you think of an example of a control that would be find a small independent bakery store? Con what they say contrast to this control activities that you would expect to find with the a large supermarket chain is it a large supermarket chain you what how it will happen if you're talking about the large supermarket chain see what happens the supermarket is basically they have they have the huge amount of cash a small independent bakery is it a small independent bakery compared to a huge huge supermarkets is it right now what is the control activity see the things now you can understand people will have cctv cameras it is nothing but a control wherever cashier is there is it at that on the assume that you are you have a cashier here is it right at the top you will have one camera is it right you will have one camera you have not one camera you will have multiple cameras is it right that's what we are talking in terms of positive CCT cam. Alarm system when shop is closed, when shop is open, it is a control activity. Agreeing of taking the till roll, is it right? You have, see what happens, see the thing, you will have the bill, is it right? You, we call it as till, is it right? We have the, now what happens whenever you have the bill, is it right? You, you will cross check, is it right? You will, as simple as that. You, you will have a, they will, they will they'll swipe the card, is it right? The moment you are swiping the card, is it right? When you swipe the card, what will happen? You will have the bill and you will have the message on your mobile. Automatically what will happen? This is nothing but the control. Is it? This is nothing but the control. Again, I will say very simple. You are swiping it. The cashier will swipe. Is it right? The cashier will swipe next time. Now you have the concept of Wi-Fi card. Is it right? Now you have the concept of Wi-Fi. Ah, that also I will tell you. Is that when you are swiping the card, the cashier will enter the amount twice. This is the control. Is that? They are entering the amount twice. Is it now you are you are using a Wi-Fi? Is it right? If the you are using the Wi-Fi, if what will happen if the amount exceeds fifty reals, you have to enter pin number. Is it again? This is a control. Is it? This is the control with respect to. That's what it says. Is that you 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 are having controls at multiple levels? Is it? You have controls at multiple levels. When you are talking about the national wide supermarket, you have to daily banking of cash by what security firm? I don't know. Whether you you will understand, you will have ATMs, is it right? Hardly we see that people, when they will refill the cash, nobody knows, is it right? Very few instances, very, very few instances, what will happen, you will come across a situation where we will have the uh, we'll see they, they will refilling the ATMs security will be there is it and large firms you will have CCTV cameras will be there you have security guards will be there these are all controls is it right we are talking about what we are talking about a bank reconciliation every week every day they will do the bank reconciliation I don't know anybody has worked in the banks. Is that if you have worked in the banks, what will happen? You have to reconcile 
at the end of the day the cash is that you have the computer inventory systems is it right that has to be taken into consideration most importantly you will have a periodic inventory checks is that we you have this concept flow to sheet and sheet to floor this will be asked in one of the examination questions means is it means what does it mean is it a physical physical inventory inventory to register is it a individual inventory to register and register to physical inventory Is it now? Now you are talking about the things what controls over self-service checkouts. See, I will I will tell you this. Is it right? You will find it very very simple. Is it right? Nowadays, if you see the hypermarkets, there is a self-service. Is it right? You can do checkouts by yourself. Is it right? You can do checkouts by yourself also. When you are doing checkouts by yourself. you put it you can you scan it you put it in that area where it is going to be scanned you take the bill you show the bill on the on the on the on the gateway or to scan it automatically the 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 bars will get open and you can come out is it see this is what the automation that's happening is it right this is where the automation happening now they have started they have started in most of the in most of the hypermarkets they have started this thing is it they are talking about these are the controls how it is there full vetting of prospective employees is that full vetting of the prospective employees when you are talking about a full vetting means you you are you are making it a point that you are screening the employees is that you are screening the employees to the extent possible and how best it is going to be have impacted with respect to the Uh, it's it they uh, before they re they recruit and after they uh, they are before they recruit you are going to have uh, the uh, full screening and during the process of during the process of the working also the uh, management uh, the management will have its own way of evaluating the employees apart from that it says that they are talking in terms of what price checks of all goods on sale against the competitors is it price checks of all goods what will happen when you are talking in terms of the price checks is it when you are talking in terms of price checks is it we, we, you will you will find the the product on the similar range is it you will not have that much discrimination as such is right now uh, if you take the example of that you will have the sale is it most of the most of the, most of the most of the uh, most of the pro, most of the uh, retail stores will have sale is right whenever there is a sale as per consumer protection act is it right the, what the rule says that you have to mention the old price is it right and you have to mention the sale price also so old price assume it is going to be 100 riyals is it right they say it is going to be 40% off they have to mention new price as 60 riyals
Is it right? They they will they they will they will give you the old price and they will give you the sale price also. This is what the controls whenever a company will offer a sale at any point of time. You you check this. It is there. They will give the old price and they will give the new. Previously, it was not there. Five years back, six years back, it is not there. But now it is as per the regulations uh, of the government that you have to make sure that what is the old price and what is the new. This is one of the mechanics of controls. Analysis of electronic point of sale data. Is that how many people? Is that we'll say how many people? We'll say in terms of what we will have in terms of total checks. Is that we'll we'll have in terms of total checks? See people who, who are in the teller, who are in the cashier. Is it right? Cashier. They have their own passwords. Is it right? They have their own password. They they will never they will never make sure that. They pass they, they, the the cash box is it right? The moment they insert the cash box, they will they will have that uh, uh, they have that uh, passcode, and the moment they will unlock it, it will come back to the in their own custody as such. Is it right? That they will do over a period of time as such. Is it right? analysis of electronic point of? Apart from that, what they will do? They will see how much you are made it in cash and how much you have made it on credit. How much you have see how much you have made it on a cash, how much you have made it on a debit card, and how much you have made it on a credit card. It it makes the things very very specific. Is it right? This is where we are talking about. Continuation that is what it says. They are talking about health and safety. They will have a health and safety audits. As simple as that. In most of the is most of the time, is it right? You will have fire drills. Is that you will have fire drills? Is that that is nothing but the safety audits? Is it right? Full recording of all health and safety in incidents. Is that you are, see very simple. These are the control activities that will have impact. Is that right? we are talking about the safety incidents? We are talking about the fire extinguishers. Check of staff leaving premises. Is that now what will happen? You have a biometric. Is it right? You have a biometric. Maybe in in some cases, in most of the organizations, it is there. Is that you when you when you are entering any 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 place, you have to scan your card. Is it right? Automatically, people will think that yes. I am just scanning the card. No, when you are have when you are when you are scanning the card, what will happen? There will be a log sheet that has been generated. Is it generated by one? Generated by information technology IT department by the systems. Is it generated by the systems? Automatically, what will happen when you what is your movement is there? Your movements will also be. Trace it out. Yes, you are moving from the here place, this place to that place. It will have impact. Is that clocking in and clocking out by the staff? And some cases they will have a mystery shoppers. It is nothing but we are talking in terms of what CCTV cameras. Is that these are the control activities this we are talking about? Is that how what it what it says is. You have, will appreciate from the previous question that control activities vary greatly depending on the nature of the size of entity. A national supermarket will have more sophisticated controls. A small uh, firm will have less controls. Is that right? You must take into account that type of entity you are auditing. Whether you are auditing a bigger one or a smaller entity. Is that right? Based on that, you should evaluate the controls. You might be asked for internal control, so it is important that you should appreciate that first. What they are telling is you as that we have to identify the type of business for whom we are doing the auditing with respect to the internal controls. Fine. Next one, monitoring of the a process to assess the effectiveness of controls. Is that whenever you are talking about about the. A monetary control. We should make that whether these controls are effective or not. 
is that this the as simple as that monitoring is nothing but the effectiveness when you are, when people will design there is no doubt on that people will implement in terms of operation but people will also make it sure that they should take some corrective actions or in in basically they should think in terms of any changes they have to change over it over a period of time who could monitor the controls it is the internal auditors is that same thing 315 what, what they say which for which of the following is not set of a component of internal control you are a control environment is a internal is a component of internal control information systems is a component of internal control whereas human resource policy is not a component of internal control what are the what are the what are the what are the limitations is that see this is a this is the advanced way of putting the thing if you make it a point we have studied is it when we are what we are when we are talking in terms of internal internal audit is it right internal audit is nothing but value for value for money audit is it right value for money audit definitely what will happen in this case the cost will increase is it in this case the cost will increase. internal control systems can only provide is it right it only provides uh, the it only provides the concepts with respect to what the cost will be there is it right? cost of control not outweighing the benefits it says that it only provides a reasonable assurance you cannot say that yes you are having cct cameras you are having you are having reconciliations you are having all those things is that in the scenario based question they will they will give all these points and they will ask what is the deficiency and what is the recommendations you don't have said that we are doing the reconciliation it's perfect is that there is only a reasonable assurance is it right because of inherent limitation cost of control not weighing the benefits is it right maybe you are you are you are spending more but you are not using you are not getting the benefits why you are not getting the benefits maybe you will not you the maybe we will will have a short of skill people maybe we have a sort of what short of experienced people is it right now we we the, no don't never assume that we have a controls there will a potential of human error will be there is it right collision between employees whenever you are going to say collision between employees we are talking about the concept of fraud is that possible of controls overridden or bypassed by the management see sometimes what will happen fine is it as simple as that you you will say that okay uh, controls are there but fine we will uh, somebody will ca call and say that okay you process this application you will say that yes it, it's not happening it, the rules are not favoring of doing this no 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 you process they will see you later is it right? sometimes there is a pressure from the management not routine transaction been difficult for the system to cope up is it right non routine transaction is one of transactions definitely it will have impact this is why auditors cannot rely on internal controls alone 
we cannot work only on internal controls what is required is you have to do substantive procedures now you understand what is the linkage what is the relationship between the internal con uh, internal controls and substantive auditors cannot rely exclusively on internal controls wherever the auditors feel that there is a risk of material misstatements the auditors have to do substantive procedures auditors are only interested in control of activities which are relevant to the financial statement that's a, as simple as, as auditors you are, you are talking only about financial statement what we are doing what we, where we are interested we are interested in terms of what accounting system as a basis of preparation of accounts we are talking in terms of whether you have prepared accounts as per the rules and regulations you have prepared accounts as per the what as per the conceptual framework is that you have prepared the accounts as per the concept financial statements as the, the as per the conceptual framework at their types of put, uh, identify the types of potential misstatement that could occur in the accounts is right they are, they are talking about what are the potential they will have some what they will say they will have some some projections is it right they will have some predictions i will not say projection they will have some predictions predictions in terms of what where the errors can happen is it right they have the prediction where the errors can happen auditors will only focus on that as simple as that they have to think out of the box understand what they have to think out of the box that is the reason when you are you are talking about the thing we have talked in the, in the in the beginning of the case you will have what you will have a you have a professional skepticism is it you have a professional skepticism you have to think in 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 a different way you have to think in such a way that you can detect a material misstatement consider the factors that affect the material mis misstatements is it right? you, you our our task is to identify the misstatements and more importantly design appropriate audit procedure for what to detect detect the risk of risk of material mistake is it to detect the mis this is the another segment fine see you have see you divide it the first one what we have done we have done with respect to the control environment is it at con components of control environment the second one we are talking in terms of limitations of the internal control systems is it right? the third one we are talking we are going to cover this is the separate segment is it right? i will put this as a separate segment point segment 3 where we are talking about how we with what name the there are different methods there are different methods to record auditors will record the accounting and control systems in place the first one is narrative notes the second one is flow charts the third one is ic q control questionnaires and evaluation questionnaires and the fourth one is checklist is it right and in 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 the in in the from the examination point of view okay from the examination point of view they will ask something on narrative notes and more importantly they will ask you on this internal control questionnaires and internal see, questionnaire means you are giving a questionnaire to them and you are asking that whether the question the controls are in their place or not understand but two things are there you are giving a questionnaire and asking them that con controls are there or not second evaluation control you are asking them that the controls are effective or not is it right see con see controls will be there but controls are effective or not 
you are asking the through the form of questionnaire. Is it? They have two things: narrative notes. Narrative notes is nothing but it is it is a writing part. Okay, it is just you are writing whatever is there. Is it? You are writing in black and white. You are taking the notes. Is it? It you are taking the notes as such. Relatively simple to record. We can record it. Is it? Advantages and disadvantages. At any point of time, I'm see my experience is they will ask any two. Okay, any two. They will not ask more than two. Is that relative simple to record? Is that what is the disadvantages? More time consuming than a more time consuming. Is it right? Can facilitate you. You make it a point. Is that can more time consuming than a flowchart? Can facilitate understanding by all team members. Is that what we have done? We have made it a point that the team members should have a common understanding. Okay, narrative notes. As simple as that. You have a flip book will be there with you. You are attending the meeting. When you attend the meeting, whatever happens, just you take down the notes. That is the example of narrative notes. You will understand better than others. You can you can make any you you can write down in between. Is it right? It is simple to record. No no instructions are there. No 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 rules and regulations are there in place. Is it right? Can facilitate understanding by team members. It is apart from that. It is flexible. Can be used by any system. It's a flexible. You can see. You you are writing here. You want you want to add something. You will put one arrow mark. You want to you want to make something. You put one star mark. Is it right? You you want to. We have done this. Whatever I am writing on the right side. Is it right? Whatever I am writing on the right side. This is called as a narrative notes. As simple as that, is it? This is called as a. This is the example of narrative. Particularly where the system follows, is it? Particularly where the system follows a logical flow. That is the flow chart, is it? It is flexible. Can be used by any system. They are awkward to update if written manually. Definitely, what happens? You have write writing. I am writing here, is it? Right on the side. Definitely. If I am writing more information, is it right? I am just filling the things. Definitely, it will be more difficult for me to make any updates. Is it right? That that is the basic thing. Editing in future can be relatively easy if we are making a computerization. If you are using Word, is it right? If you are using Word, very simple. I will give this example. You are sending that that ISA standards. Is it right? The ISA standards, which you are sending as a text message, it is a narrative notes. Is it a narrative notes? Is it means you can make amendments, you can you can change the things as per the requirements, you can shuffle the things up and down as 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 best as possible. There is a lot of flexibility there in that message. That is the best example of narrative notes. flow chart is a constructive you uh, you maybe you have done ais accounting information systems is it right in accounting information systems the concept of flow chart is there is it right? it's a very technical one once it has been drawn it is very difficult to change is it right it is very difficult to change it has some rules conditions is it right it has some some terms and conditions Is it? It has some terms and conditions. It is difficult to change. Is it right? difficult? Difficult to modify. Is it? The rules are there. Is it? When you say there is a start, there is a stop. Is it? Start. There is a end. Is it? Some, some, some. These are the decisions. If you, if you put a diamond shape, it means it is, it is the way. We are talking in terms of decision, is it? When you are talking in terms of of a of a a, a, a quadrilateral like this, this is nothing but we are talking in terms of processing. When you are talking in terms of a rectangle, it is nothing but a data storage, is it? Set calendar reminder for fifteen days. It is a data storage, is it? That that is the reason. 
when we we are we are see what happens if it is in this in this rectangle slantly rectangle phase it is nothing but you are processing it you are processing it you take the decision this is the concept of a flow chart see some people are good by reading some people are good by by uh, seeing the diagrams some people are good in the questionnaires some people are good in the checklist okay every every one has their every method will have their own limitations and advantages and disadvantages is it can be prepared quickly standard format format is there with some rules and regulations which is for easy to follow and review it ensure system is recorded in entirety means what will happen there is a start and there is a end we will not put anything we are we are we are not eliminate extensive we are not writing any stories is it right we are just putting what is needed that's what it say what is there they say yes or no is it right we are, we are talking about yes or no invoice paid yes or no if not paid what is the action if paid what is the action is it right if not paid what to do if have paid what to do is it right? that that's very very specific disadvantages generally not suitable for standard systems is it right means you are not if anything standard is there they say that it is not suitable fine the advantages and disadvantages go side by side major changes we cannot do any changes is it right once is done is done time wasted in charting areas of no audit significance people say that why it is not that much important but flow charts most why flow charts is is that much important why they are they say now most of the see most of the accounting accounting soft accounting is is done by is done by automation is it and is done by atom when you talk about the thing the flow chart is it right the flow chart is the technique is it right is the technique used in used in information technology is it right that is the reason we are discussing this year that is the reason we are discussing because we are using lot of automation we are using lot of information systems as a supporting feature when you are using it as a supporting factor definitely we should take some inputs from the information technology core concepts is it now this is related to the auditing there is a questionnaire first we are talking about the questionnaire the second we are talking about the evaluation what is the difference between these two a questionnaire is whether it is good in this how good is systems is working controls is it right internal control you will ask yes it 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 is yes or it is no list of question to determine whether the controls are present or no you will say is it strongly agree agree neutral strongly disagree disagree and strongly disagree you will put you what you will do you will put point scale 5 4 3 2 1 1 1 one list of questions for each major transaction is it that that's what it say is it whether you say the internal control questionnaires you are giving the questionnaires and you are doing internal control evaluation questionnaire what you are doing you focus whether the errors are frauds or possible we are not establishing is it right here what we are doing we are establishing we want to know is it right? whether the controls are there but here rather than establishing we want to have the whether there is any possibility is there or not is it definitely that that what it say evaluation means yes if you say that there is a there is a yes is it then you will ask you will make it a point that how it is yes and how it is no you will say that yes it is no then you will what you will ask you will ask what is the reason evaluation talks about the logic 
is it evaluation talks what is the reason and what is the effect result evaluation talks about the logic whereas internal question question about the establish whether you want to know whether it is yes or whether it is no key questions are control question for each transaction stream is it for what happens see the thing for sales you will have different set of question for purchases you have a different set of question here what we are doing we are talking in terms of general terms here we are talking in terms of specific terms is it just keep it in 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 mind what the concept of see four things are there the first one is narrative notes the second one is flow charts the third one is internal control questionnaires the fourth one is internal control evaluation questionnaires and the last one is what we are talking in terms of the checklist is that the same thing it drafted through what what are the questionnaires what are the how it will work is it right we are we will complete this and we'll stop here okay uh, if drafted thoroughly they can ensure all controls are con that that's what you are talking of giving a questionnaire is it right they are quick to prepare they are easy and uh, they are easy to use and control questionnaires there is no problem as such you don't want anything else is right you just have to have to say whether it is exist or whether it is not exist because they are drafted in terms of, of for specific purpose internal control evaluation questionnaire are easy to apply is it that that's the reason we are, we are we are giving the thing we we go for sales is it right what what i have told when we, we here we are talking in terms of evaluation questionnaire for sales for purchases is it for inventory if you are doing that what we are doing we are getting the specific questionnaire whereas internal control questionnaires are general in nature internal evaluation questionnaires are specific in nature this is the basic difference between these two write down somewhere in your notes is it somewhere that's what it says they should enable the auditors to identify what are the controls is it we will say that yes in terms of purchases is it in terms of purchases now when they are receiving the things is it when they, when you purchase you will receive what will happen goods received note goods received note is going to be going to be match with what is going to be match with purchase invoice is it it is going it is going to be match with what it is going to be match with the purchase suppliers list purchase the means we are purchasing from the supply approved people or not is it right we are buying from the approved people or not it will be where it will be it will be matched with what it will be matched with the purchase order if you put this process into consideration it is called as a substantive procedure this is what in other words one side substantive procedure another side internal control evaluation is it internal uh, evaluation question is it means that is what it says we, when we we want to make sure that we are evaluating we are we are we are ensuring that the process is done in complete or not internal control evaluation questionnaires can highlight deficiencies we we are we are receiving the things you you have to match with invoice you have to match with the approved list you have matched with the purchase order automatic list with if there is any gap it means there is a deficiency is that in the exam in the question they will ask you like this only in the question they will ask like this only what is the what is the process of inventory what is the when you receive what is the process when you dispatch what is the process when you are purchasing the assets what is the process is it right you have to have that in a sequential order fine what are the disadvantages 
it drafted vaguely may be misunderstood is it for every advantage there is a disadvantage they will not ask you advantages or disadvantages they will ask you deficiencies and recommendations it may have irrelevant controls will be there they are having some unusual controls will be there see you you can criticize as as you wish is it right? if the, for the advantage we can say we can have a disadvantage they can give false impression that all are having equal weight no they will never have a equal weight every every question will have its own importance is right the client may be ever overstate to have a overstating the controls as such is right means these are very specific definitely compared to narrative notes compared to flow charts is it compared to narrative notes and compared to flow charts this is as a auditor what you will do understand from this as an auditor when you go to the client place you will take the questionnaire and you will give it to the clients employees is it right you give it to the employees employees will tick it it is like a data collection is it right? you will come back you will analyze it and you will say that whether there is controls and you will analyze it it nothing but you are evaluating it is it nothing but you are evaluating it is it the last one you are talking about the checklist very simple what is the checklist you you will have boxes is it right if it is there yes if it is not there it is no you are ticking the boxes to indicate the statement so true or not share may share many advantages and disadvantage with the questionnaire as a similar to the question what they say you could be tested on the documentation on the documentation understand point when we say on the documentation what are the thing you are talking in terms of na narrative notes is it right you are talking what these are the examples these are the concepts of document narrative notes you are talking in terms of flow charts is it right you are talking in terms of flow chart you are talking on internal control questionnaires and internal control evaluation questionnaires and recently they have put this one previously it was not there is it there is six marks part question where we are talking about advantages or disadvantages of what internal control and internal control evaluation question is it right i will stop here fine i will stop here can i stop here Yes. Okay. Yes. Now, fine. Uh, I will stop here. Uh, on on Saturday we will have class from.